Well, just pulled up to the river, about to cross this thing and uh, do an evening hunt. Got this evening and then a full day tomorrow to turkey hunt, but I got to work tomorrow. So I'm only going to be able to hunt in the morning and in the afternoon trying to film my last tag. Getting everything ready because I'm about to go trekking across the river. Let's see if you can see the waders. Where's the waders at back there? Uh, trekking across the river and uh, going to try and get on a bird that we've been seeing over here. So anyways, I'm going to get everything ready, put on my waders and walk across this river and get set up. All right, so here we go. I have got a handful and uh, this river is flowing pretty decently. So might be a little interesting trying to get across this thing. Didn't fall this morning, but may fall this afternoon. sneak up here to this high point and scan these fields where this bird's normally at just to make sure that he ain't out here just yet. Wouldn't be no good to hunt him if he spooked. I'm gonna sneak out to this middle field right behind me. There's another little knob on the other side and there's a neighboring property that the birds like to get out in but they've been roosting over here on this ridge where there's a lot of pine trees. So either they're gonna come through there and probably roost over here or they're just gonna stay over there. It, it's hard to say. Uh, you can kind of get an idea what they're gonna do and then they do something different, but I almost fail. If I get in the middle of this field and set a hen up and do a little bit of calling, maybe I can catch one coming through here. It's still pretty early, so there's a really good chance they'll come out in this field and just feed around. And most of the time, whenever we see this gobbler he's by himself so just really a good opportunity to kill him that's the plan anyways all right so i'm gonna get tucked up right in there underneath those cedars and put the decoy out there in front of me somewhere not a bad setup
my gosh. <laughs> Tagged out in Arkansas, baby. Oh my gosh. I gotta go get him. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh. Flopping. That's a far shot. Holy crap. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Woo yes. <sighs> Holy cow. Oh my goodness. I know what to say. This is, I was just sitting here watching YouTube videos and I looked to my left and here comes three longbeards and they caught me so far off guard. Oh my gosh. <laughs> had my gun down, slowly had to raise it up turned my GoPro on and everything and made some weird ow, 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 with my mouth to get on the stop. And I, <laughs> I shot him, I don't even know how far that shot was. That was probably like a 45 yard shot, something like that. Oh my goodness. I had not killed a bird in Arkansas in three years and killed one uh, about a week ago. <sighs> killed a bird in Missouri this weekend. Oh my goodness, this has been the best season ever. Self to film turkey hunt, tagged out in Arkansas. Tomorrow's the last day. Man, God is so good. I put a lot of effort into this year, uh, a lot of effort into studying, knowing where birds are, weeks before season started, listening to different areas, trying to find birds. And that first week we were on birds left and right and had some issues happen. And to be tagged out with a day left here in Arkansas, it's really just a a blessing uh, it really is honestly I just be able to come out here and hunt these <laughs> irritating and awesome creatures I just I can't believe it it's got some nice he's got some nice hooks got a little hook going on a nice little beard beautiful bird beautiful bird that's just awesome right there holy cow well guys tag down in Arkansas if you enjoyed this episode make sure to hit that like button comment down below if you've ever tagged out in the state before, I'm sure some of you have, because you are better turkey hunters than me. And uh, make sure to subscribe, because just some great content that's going to be coming even after this episode. So make sure you subscribe. And uh, I'm just going to sit here and kind of relish the moment. Woo! Woo! Baby, it gets me popped up. Popped up.